Well, a very warm welcome to you on this most pleasantly clear evening. Conditions absolutely beautiful. Perfect for the beautiful game. Temperatures are kind as well. No doubt playing a hand in high attendance levels as well as an elevated level of anticipation here. Surely this is the hot ticket going around in this neck of the woods. It surely must be. Stade Louis Dur, not one of the biggest grounds, but certainly one that serves up a very unique atmosphere. This is the perfect game for all parties, not least the neutrals who've just come to enjoy it. Well, on the face of it, Peter, we would appear to have a high-caliber meeting with very little at stake. But then you consider a, a chance for one or two of the fringe players to get a look in, and this becomes a big incentive. It changes the dynamic. So there's plenty at stake for them, which will do no harm to the energy levels and the overall conviction and hopefully the style of contest. Oh, oh, the stadium is very nice. So we're up and running. Jim, who do you pick out as the telling individual today? Yeah, Jorginho. The kind of player that can pass a team to death. At first, a lot of his passes seem a little safe and conservative, but they all serve a, a bigger purpose, slowly shifting the opposition from side to side. Once there is that little bit of space to work in, then the killer instinct usually kicks in and he's able to deliver that decisive pass. Yes, he'd be my pick too. It's going to be all about how they get the best out of him. Mm -hmm. Griezmann. Griezmann. Griezmann! Oh. And it was a chance, but a to drink for the keeper. Look, it, it was achievable, Peter, but it needed his best. Kovacic tries to switch the play. Good challenge, he just stood firm. João Cancelo. He's got away. Lops it in gently. Jorginho. And they've been caught out here. That's offside. Yes, it is. This man. Just to point out, Peter, that the fullbacks are quite high. And what do they try to achieve? Well, it's obviously a move. To... It's William! Oh. It's there! Really? William. Perfect placement. The one place the keeper couldn't reach. Well, I think two keepers would have had a hard time keeping that one out. Never mind one. There was real venom in the strike and, and clear composure from the placement. Manchester trail at this early stage. How will they respond? They didn't manage to get nearly enough into the box, and that speaks of little ambition. Marcos Alonso. And here's Giroud. Laporte battles to win it back. Messi has been caught there. It's a foul. Stones. And it's messy. Lovely bit of skill there. He wasn't very far from making something happen by himself. Lovely to see. Pulisic. Going through.
Kot. Ada ini tu. Kamu tu. Pulisic delivers. Too much on it and out of play. Forward it goes. Jao Cancelo plays it forward. Chance to break. Bernardino goes looking. Rudiger tries to get it forward quickly. And here's Shu looking for goal! Straight at the keeper. William might be slightly consoled by at least hitting the target. Now it's Sterling. And here's Griezmann. Silva. And here's Messi. He's gone for it! Just off target. Well, I suppose it wasn't the worst attempt if you consider how far out he was. out of harm's way to Bruyne. Lovely bit of skill. William absolutely focused then on the defensive side of his game. I think it's great to see that kind of application and desire from a forward who wants to help out his defence. I, I think, you know, any good team really, your striker should be the first line of that defence and, and he's delivering. To the goalkeeper, Jao Cancelo. Fernandinho approaching half time and still behind. Can they make something happen now? And it's Sterling. Now it's Giroud. Plays it out to the flank. Now it's Giroud. Played out to the right. William. Massive lead. They've done it. A two-goal lead and they're firmly in control. Well, you know, thinking about that, I think they've perfected that on the training ground because it took them seconds to get the ball from back Play to front. All. They really commit forward in numbers too. It was all very well drilled. Chelsea take a two-goal lead and things should be comfortable from here on in. Well, at 1-0, this contest was still nicely poised, but now that it's gone to two... Messi! Well, I'm not quite sure he needed to hold up play quite as much as he did then. A couple of his teammates were very annoyed. Giroud, and here's William, out to the right. And he's got the ball glued to his feet. Just brushed off the ball there. And we hit half-time. Any strong opinions on the first half? Well, it's looking pretty straightforward, Peter. They've got themselves into a, a very good position, so why dither from here when they can repeat their first-half success with a, another show of strength? That gets things going for the second half. Well, this half might require them to produce a plan A, B and C. Leveling the score is easier said than done, but that will be the target. Get back on terms and then use that momentum to go again. And it's Giroud. 
And here's William. And that's sprayed out wide. And here's a corner. Looks to set one up to meet it. And a second time. And that has skimmed the post. That's just plain unlucky. There were many, me included, who thought that was going in. Christensen. Rubica. Kovacic. Raspilicueta. Plays it out to the flank. Fernandinho. De Bruyne. De Bruyne drives it forward. Hoisted towards the area. That's a case of crossing in hope. And unless they provide some more options, it'll be more missed than hit. A slightly better ball would have led to a very different outcome yeah. there. Uh, that was just poor. It's Griezmann! Oh, that's a terrific save from the keeper. Well, what can I say? Truly wonderful goalkeeper. Goal kick. Mendy gets into the right position to intercept. And here's Sterling. And here's Griezmann. Griezmann! Oh. Well, that wasn't too dissimilar to the previous attempt. They're just lacking a cutting edge, Peter. And while that's fairly obvious, the rest of their attacking play is actually Manna. quite good. And the weighted pass, Pulisic. Messi. Fernandinho. Hoists it forward. As Pliqueta goes well to read it and intercepts. And it's Marcos Alonso. Raspilicueta. William. Gets away from his opponents. And he's looking at the referee, but the referee is shaking his head. Griezmann. It's man. Rudiger. Jorginho. Marcos Alonso. Looking crossfield, changing the point of attack. De Bruyne gets it back. That's an untidy challenge. Free kick given. Fabinho. And he's going long. Joe. And he's cut it out. Fernandinho. There really wasn't very much Fernandinho. in that. Not far away from being a telling final ball. Look, the game is full of ifs and buts. If only the, the pass could have completed its journey. The three. 
William has a look up from the right-hand side, seeking out options. Yeah, that does look a foul. Referee's given a free kick. Raspilicueta. Marcos Alonso hits that long. Uh, he acknowledges that he should have come up with something better there. Uh, Peter, his body shape was a giveaway before he made the... It's Griezmann! Griezmann! Oh! And they are dragging it back! Go, 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 go. The lightness of step, the sharpness of oh, movement, oh, yeah, the certainty hard. of finish. That's always a great sign for yeah, yeah. football pitch. Need the footage, they play so balance and lead the ball ahead to finish. Oh, and Fanny Goodman is really smart. This is again, Messi, Sly, This man, left, high, left, right. I look at this higher, so he's really good, let's go. There's going to be another change here. Yeah, it's pretty obvious as to who was going to be taken off. His energy levels began to, to sag, and he was never going to last until the final whistle. Manchester get themselves back into contention. I think they've done so well to get back in it, but it's important now that they don't become over-eager in chasing another. Whistle's gone, that's a foul. And the referee has shown him a yellow card. I think it's time for them to concentrate on closing this one out. Kovacic. Oh, good take in a good area. That's Piliqueta. Kovacic. Hudson-Otoi. Into a minimum of four minutes additional time. Whistle's gone, and they've got themselves a free kick. Well, I think the alternative was to stand there and, and do nothing while he, he tried to score, and obviously he's not going to allow that, Peter, is he? It's broken loose! And it's William. William! Well, that's where he wants it. This man... That's Piliqueta. And oh, time oh. is up. Manchester moves by the odd goal. It could have gone either way. One. That is no Jersey consolation. Two. So, Jim, how do you reflect on what we've seen? Manchester didn't quite recover from the early blow, Peter. After